Hey, what's up, family? Senor Cigar here. You are wherever you are. Hopefully practicing social distancing, staying safe, staying hydrated, all of that. It is Thursday. Time for the New York CNS Virtual Herf and Family. I tell you, I tried. I really tried. Got downtown, Lower Manhattan, Soho, Father Fagan Park. It's chilly out there. But I put some smoke in the air with an Avo Heritage Special Toro, that 6x60 that I like so much. Tried to shoot video, too cold. Once again, freezing up the, uh, the phone. Uh, so here we are, once again. Uh, I'm on the job, I'm at the job site. I am uh, in one of the studios. And uh, here we go. So. Shout out to the medical professionals, first responders, EMS workers, police and fire, postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country, the mom and pop shop owners, the bodega shop owners, the laundromat owners, anybody who has been considered or deemed essential personnel. Thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety. Thank you for being out there and uh, taking care of us right in this city, in this state in and around this country, what you have been doing, it is so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough, but we do start out by saying thank you for everything you have been doing during the pandemic. And of course, family, you know I'm gonna remind you about this every single time I do one of these. Please check in on the elders of your family. Your family and friends who live alone, they need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. So please reach out to them any way you can whether it's through a phone call, a text message, a social media video chat, Zoom, House Party, Google Duo, FaceTime, Skype. And remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with their elders and their family and friends who live alone. No one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. So please take the time, make the time. Reach out, find out how they're doing, see if they need anything, see if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem, family. It is all about support. And of course, while we are talking about support, let us not forget about all those fine ladies and gentlemen, all those great people that own those great cigar shops and lounges, those great mom and pop shops, those great small businesses out here in the tri-state area. Family, they need our support now more than ever. Whether it's a shop where you can come in, make your purchase, grab and go, or maybe it's a lounge with comfortable seating where you can come in, make that purchase, find a spot to plop, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air, maybe pair that fine tobacco product with your drink of choice. Now, you know when I'm putting some smoke in the air, you know Senor has to do the diet, mountain, do. Ah, oh yeah. And maybe even have a conversation with another brother or sister of Leaf. But family, please understand, none of that can be done unless you make the effort to go to that mom and pop shop. So what are we talking here? We are talking breaking open that piggy bank, fellas, opening up that wallet, blow the dust out, pull out some dollar, dollar bills, y'all, and make your way to that mom and pop shop. How you going to get there? Going to jump in your ride? Or maybe you're going to let somebody else do the driving for you by getting in an Uber or a Lyft. Huh? Or maybe you're going to do a bicycle. Maybe you're going to do an e-bike or a moped. Or maybe you're going <clears> to <throat> jump on your motorcycle. Or, crazy, pogo stick, skateboard. Roller skates, I said roller skates, and make your way down to that mom and pop shop. And once you get there, you're going to walk right in, take a look around, make your selections, 
then proudly step up to that cash register and make it rain, baby. Make it rain. Spend a few dollars to keep their cash register ringing and their doors open because it is all about support. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. Hashtag support black business. Hashtag support Latino business. Hashtag support Asian business. Hashtag support small business. Family, we are all in this together and we need each other now more than ever. So please take the time, make the time to go out and support small business. Support those mom and pop shops. It is the right thing to do. All right, Sam. So listen, what's the plan for tonight? As, as, as you can see, I'm at work. I'm getting ready to start my my work day in, in just a little while. But what about you? You're at the end of your day, right? Or maybe you're getting ready to be at the end of your day. So what's the plan? Where are we going? What are we doing? Maybe you're going to have dinner with that uh, very significant other, a nice romantic meal. Or maybe... You decided you want to go hang out at a bar with a few friends, throw some back, pound a few down. Or maybe you decided you want to go to that nice uh, cigar lounge, that mom and pop shop, meet up with some brothers and sisters of the leaf and put some smoke in the air. Oh, yeah. Or maybe you got tickets to see a movie or Broadway show or a concert or a comedy show. Or uh, maybe you decided you want to sing a little karaoke. <coughs> Family, whatever you got planned for tonight, tomorrow night, this weekend, or any night moving forward, please make sure that a part of that plan is staying safe. Stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. This coronavirus is no joke. This is something we have never experienced before. And we really need to do all we can to avoid this virus, this pandemic, right? Stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. We have lost so many lives. We have lost too many lives, and we don't want to lose any more. So please do all you can. And a part of staying safe, staying hydrated, yo. Whenever you go out, make sure you got that bottle of water, that lemonade, or that iced tea, or whatever you need to stay refreshed and hydrated. I'm telling you, fam, take it from Senor Cigar. This is a bit of advice that you are going to want to take, and you will thank me later. All right? So once again, if you're going out tonight, tomorrow night, whenever, stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. Family, I'm going to wrap this up for today because I'm getting ready to uh, do my thing, press those buttons, ride those levels, do what I do. So please do not forget. Check in on the elders of your family. Your family and friends who live alone, they need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together we will get through this. And yes, we will get through this. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. And whenever you go out, whether it's tonight, tomorrow night, this weekend, any night moving forward, please make sure that you have a plan to stay safe. So you can stay healthy. So you can stay alive. All right, fam. That is it. That is all I got. I am that man. Senor Cigar. I have already enjoyed my fine tobacco products. So now it's kind of get to the work. But you know, I'm always popping my collar because I can. And as always, I want to wish you long ashes and better days. Everybody, enjoy the rest of your Thursday. And at some point, I do hope you'll be able to put some smoke in the air. 
Y'all know I love you like a fat kid loves cake, and I hope to talk to you again real soon, hopefully, tomorrow. But in the meantime, holla if you hear me. All right, now. Yeah, baby.